Hello everyone and welcome to This Week in Net. We usually don't have episodes in August, but this is a special occasion for a teaser of one of our innovation weeks, AI Week. It starts next week. I'm your host, Juan Tomé, based in Lisbon, Portugal, and with me I have Kenny Johnson. Hello, Kenny. How are you? Hey there. Thanks for having me. Uh, for those who don't know, what is AI Week? We typically do several innovation weeks throughout the year, but in this case, we have a, a, an AI Week in August. What should you know? Yeah, we're very, very excited to put on an AI Week in this uh, upcoming week. The the big, big focus is that it's it's obviously no secret that AI tools are taking over the world, but that innovation is often outpacing security controls and governance, as well as the tools that exist to build great AI experiences. So there's going to be a mix of a little bit of everything, but the, the primary focuses of the week are going to be around how do you secure access to your employees using AI tools? How do you take back control of your content from AI bots and scrapers? And then how do you build great AI experiences, most importantly, with security batteries included? So we want to make sure that any any AI experiences that are being built have uh, security built in by default. So those are going to be the primary focuses by the week. We've got lots of exciting features coming. It's interesting because on July the 1st, we had what we call the Content Independence Day with the new features there. This is much more than that in terms of workflows, AI environments in, in, in companies, as you mentioned, uh, not only protecting original content, but also helping developers be AI driven, but also secure doing that, right? Uh, it's it's many topics that we cover in this AI week, uh, even how we make Cloudflare better using uh, machine learning tools, uh, automated tools, really, right? Yeah, 100%. So the, the kind of the start of the week, we're going to dig into how to how to secure employee access to AI, doing things like detecting AI tools you didn't know people are using, um, giving it employees better and more secure ways to access AI tools. Then we'll continue our momentum around uh, allowing content creators to take back control of their content. Um, and then, as you said, uh, empowering developers to be able to build better and better AI tools, as well as turbocharging Cloudflare with more AI embedded experiences to find uh, needle in the haystack issues when you've got hundreds of thousands or millions of logs uh, oftentimes that a lot of our customers have. In terms of content, as usual, the content will be in our blog, many blog posts per day. Uh, as usual, also on, on Cloudflare TV, there will be segments for people to browse and a hub for them to explore. Uh, from the blogs you've, you've seen uh, and announcements, uh, did something surprise you? Maybe not in detail that we don't want to, to say already, but at least in the large part of ideas, uh, something surprised you from what you saw? Yeah, great question. I, I think the big one is is really around some of the work that our team was able to do to detect AI usage in a company. I think that's something that's really on the forefront of a lot of CISO security folks, as well as even leadership uh, of many companies. And I was really impressed by what that, that specific team was able to put together um, in terms of the actual product behind that so keep an eye out for that blog that one's going to be really special uh, you also talked specifically with customers with even analysts um, what are people trying to get from uh, from from us specifically these days that potentially could be answered next week yeah 100 percent. so there's that piece of understanding what what employee what ai tools employees are using but the other big piece that i think a lot of people are talking about is there are not a lot of great ways to build kind of the the approved path or the paved path is, is how some customers have talked about it of, hey, I've got everybody using everything. There's not even great tools for me as a, an application development team or as a security team to give some somebody the approved way to, to access these tools. So that's going to be another big focus that we're, we're working on is with our developer products and our security products, you're going to be able to build experiences that look and feel very similar to a consumer AI application with enterprise level security controls and governance in place, which I think is really going to be incredible. And all, all of this will be available in the blog, uh, but the hub is callfair.com slash AI dash week, right? Yes, correct. Um, okay. We'll have a lot to explore next week in the following days. Um, and you have also a blog post on Sunday to set uh, things in motion for for the week uh, specifically a lot to to come uh in the next few days right yeah absolutely we are very excited stay tuned keep an eye out for the welcome blog going out on sunday we'll tease some additional content there and then definitely keep an eye out on the blog throughout the week there's gonna be lots of exciting blogs as well as product features to try out in the dashboard and that's a teaser thank you kenny it's done awesome thank you and that's a wrap